We are nearing the busiest travel season of the year, and luckily, gas prices are falling. So the question is, how low are they going to go? News Ace Emily Leonard here now with some answers. Joining me is West Michigan native Patrick DeHaan from GasBuddy.com. And Patrick, we're seeing prices fall a little bit right now. What is driving that drop? Well, Emily, it's a function really of an improvement. We've covered refinery issues. That was the reason prices have shot up in the last month and a half. Now it's an improvement in refinery issues. In fact, quite the opposite. Now it looks like the numbers are just in free fall. So uh, an improvement in refineries, uh, a drop in oil prices, all helping to precipitate a pretty substantial decline, uh, not only into Thanksgiving, but could be beyond that. In fact, some of the numbers right now could support prices at some stations in Michigan falling under $3 a gallon over the next few weeks. Boy, that is really good news because we are seeing some prices around $3 a gallon at some stations in Metro Detroit. Why aren't we seeing that here right now? Well, simply all about competition. Uh, some areas of Caledonia last week, stations held their prices very high. There was lack of aggressive competition. That's what it's going to take. Uh, we're seeing some of those pockets of competition right now. The station on Michigan and Fuller, certainly one of the cheapest in West Michigan at 371. So shop around or certainly far lower prices depending on where you fill up. All right. So if people have Thanksgiving plans to drive, should they be filling up right now or should they wait until the weekend, maybe next week? They shouldn't be in any rush to fill your tanks. Gas prices will continue falling at basically every station across the state as we progress closer to Thanksgiving. So if it's me, uh, fill up when you go. Don't fill up in advance. Okay, so a lot of people will head to the Chicagoland area where you live for the holiday. Where's the best spot to fill up um, on that drive or in that area? Well, I would say anywhere up until Michigan City, anywhere in Michigan, shop around on your way down. But once you get to about Hammond, Indiana, and Northwest Indiana, you'll notice prices go up dramatically. And of course, Chicagoland prices tend to be much higher as well. We're at about 420 to 450 a gallon. So get it in West Michigan or get it close to the border, but avoid Northwest Indiana. Makes sense. Makes sense. Okay, so let's peek ahead toward the end of the year. What should we expect to happen with prices over the next few weeks? Well, Emily, as long as a refinery in, in Northwest Indiana, the BP refinery gets back online for maintenance, it should be there very soon. We could see gas prices falling another 25, maybe 50 to 70 cents a gallon. So there's a long way for us to go. As long as nothing bad happens, knock on wood, we could see gas prices, like I said, some of those 299s could show up in West Michigan in time for Christmas. Oh, that'd be a nice present. Patrick DeHaan from GasBuddy.com. Thank you. Thanks, Emily. And if you want to figure out where to find the cheapest gasoline near you, all you have to do is head to our website, woodtv.com, and look under the traffic tab.